These BMW 7 Series are absolutely stunning. And this particular car is an individual. Being a 2005 model, it's the Update Series. So it got the bigger 4.8 litre V8 engine and was known as the 750i. The old 750i used to be a V12. And the 750 in this series from 2005 to about 2008 has the 4.8 litre V12. It's carbon Schwartz in colour and it's done 89,000 kilometres from new. It's got this beautiful two-tone beige interior, beige and black interior, which actually makes a lot of sense because the seats are beige or cream, yet the roof is actually, the roof is cream as well actually, but the dash is black. And if you look closely, it's actually stitched leather. Most of the sports have black roofs, but this has been optioned if you look closely again, it's stitched and it looks absolutely stunning. I believe that fabric's called Alcantara. It's got soft closed doors. What I love about the BMW 7 Series and especially the individual is the wheels. I think BMW 7 Series from this era had some of the best looking wheels on any car. To the extent there's some cars I would buy, which I would probably put wheels similar to this on. Like Mercedes, for example, their wheels look quite soft, whereas the BMW have always had the BBS mesh style rim, and they just look fantastic. For me personally, wheels are a pretty big thing on a car and they can make a huge difference in terms of the looks. The individual also came with these individual badges and lights. It's got lights under the door here as well, which you can't, or you can, are they on at the moment? They're not on at the moment, which look great. It's got continental tires, low kilometers, and looking at this car, you would not think it was from 2005. To me, it looks like a car which is about three or four years old. So the BMW individual series with a good colour and wheel package will always look fantastic, even if you look at the old 7 series from the 80s and the 90s. If they're in good condition, are a good colour with a nice set of wheels, obviously BMW wheels, factory wheels are the best. I don't like aftermarket wheels, obviously. Um, it'll always look good. And they've really got down to a, a price which I think is affordable. And if they're looked after, they are relatively inexpensive to run other than things like petrol, obviously. You wouldn't buy this because it's economical. You'd buy it because it's beautiful to drive. It's got a lot of power and it's smooth. It's got the individual steering wheel. Navigation. We'll start the car up. It's got keyless go. I've got the key in my pocket. Service isn't due for another 6,000 Ks or 13 months. Let's have a look here, 167 left. So around town, moving it around here, it's suggesting that it uses 18 litres per 100 k's. That's definitely on the high side. There's your cup holders, your phone. They really are incredible cars. Just looking at the menu up here. So communication, obviously, entertainment, navigation is where it was on before. And with the old SIM card telephones, what you can do is you can actually put a SIM card in here if you've got a spare one. And um, what I used to do when I used to drive one of these is I used to, on a trip, divert my mobile phone to the car phone. So if people were ringing me, it had come through to the car and I had that nice, clear phone call and a very clear line. It's got a rear blind as well. 
It's got the beautiful individual steering wheel. And it really is just one of those cars. I could do a video for about 20 minutes. It just looks gorgeous from every angle. And I really like the colour combination. It's just stunning. And it's a car anyone would be very proud to own. There's a couple of marks on the wheels, so we'll send the car to our wheel specialist and he'll get the little marks out of those wheels, which will bring up the car beautifully. Well, thank you for taking the time to watch our video. We're very proud to offer you this BMW 750i at the Old Timer Centre. Thanks again for watching.